Hello lovely brides and welcome back to my channel. I'm Lauren, wedding planner and owner of Bluebird Creative. If you haven't already, then make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit the bell for a weekly dose of wedding planning goodness. This week I am following on from last week's video, which was about continuing your wedding during lockdown. I'll link it up here for you if you haven't seen it yet. Today is diving into one of the topics and one of the points that I spoke about, and that is using online resources to level up your wedding planning during this crazy time that we are currently going through. So without further ado, let's just dive straight on in because I am too blooming excited. Let's go. Okay, so number one, we are talking calligraphy. Have you thought about having calligraphy on your wedding stationery? Have you thought about doing it yourself? Now is the time to learn. There are so many amazing calligraphers out there that teach calligraphy at workshops and those that have been super savvy have managed to put those workshops online in super quick time, I hasten to add. Some of them may have already been a step ahead and had online courses anyway, but some that didn't have managed to make a really quick switch and get them online at an even cheaper price point because it's not in person to provide still an amazing service for you guys out there. One of my suppliers has done exactly that and she even sends out the calligraphy pen, the ink, the pads and some of the work and then you get emailed to the tutorials. I will link all the resources to this video in the comments below so make sure you scroll through and have a check and check them out because they're amazing. So definitely do that. I have done a calligraphy course because you will be amazed at the amount of times almost every wedding I have had to get my calligraphy pen and ink out and had to do a last minute emergency piece of calligraphy. I am no pro and I'm actually thinking of taking one of these courses again just to brush up on my skills because I've been surprised at the amount of times I've had to use it. But why not do it for yourself? You would be so proud to be able to look at your wedding day and be like, did that myself, I learned how to do that. So take this time to learn something new. My second find is online floral styling tutorials. Now I am sure that there are plenty out there and lots of different styles, lots of different styles of teacher, lots of different styles of workshops. There are two that I have found in particular, again people that I have worked with before and they have moved courses online for you guys during this time and I think it's absolutely amazing. Now both these guys are actually working with dried flowers. Now the reason I've decided to feature these particular styles is because if you wanted to create something for your wedding day and you wanted to take time to create it now, if you use dried flowers they're gonna last. So for example, Botanical Tales, again, I'm linking it all below, is owned by Bex Partridge. She even has a book out. Her stuff is phenomenal. Her Instagram is just to die for. You must check her out. I'm in love with her. She has got a tutorial that's coming up in May that teaches you to make a seasonal wreath. That doesn't mean a Christmas wreath, that just means a seasonal wreath using foraged pieces. So that's not even dry stuff. You can dry it yourself, you can find what's in your garden, you can learn some skills, and then you can always create something closer to your wedding date or keep what you've made. I think it's a lovely idea. Kate Avery Flowers, who is a Surrey-based wedding florist, has created an online workshop where you place an order and she delivers the dried flowers for you and then emails over the tutorial. And it's actually for a small hoop, which I personally think is amazing for weddings. You can use them as a little feature piece. You could even use them as centerpieces. It can be something that can be made now and you can still have it on your wedding day because it's dried so it will last. So I've picked these particular ones because I personally think that they are fantastic and that they can really be used for your wedding day. But there are so many other suppliers and florists out there doing something amazing and getting some of their work online. So definitely keep your eyes out. If these ones aren't for you, then keep looking because this would be an amazing string to your bow for your wedding planning. Okay, so number three is online wedding planning. So Bluebird Creative, Bride Academy, which is me, actually have an online wedding planning 
course. So if you're spending this time right now going, okay, well, I really, really want to get ahead with my wedding planning. I don't really know what I'm doing. You are not the first person to say that, hence why I created the course, which has been closed and wasn't going to be opened till May. But I decided with everything that's going on that I would open the doors to the course. It only opens two to three times a year, but I'm leaving it open for the time being. And not only that, I'm actually opening it at a mega, mega discount just to bring a little bit of sunshine back to everybody at this time. Now, if you're thinking, okay, what does an online wedding planning co course, an online wedding planning course include, then it's basically your A to Z. It is a blueprint of your wedding planning. It takes you through right from the beginning, right to the end of your wedding planning, telling you how to work out your guest list and talks about stationery, the ceremony, reception, the drinks reception, etiquette, how to word your stationery, how to plan the on the day schedule, everything. It is absolutely everything all tied up in a 10 module online course. I'll link it below for you. There's also a free starter course for you to check it out just so you can see what the format's like and what the content would be like if you're not quite sure. But if you're using this time right now to crack on with your wedding planning and you just don't quite know where to turn and you don't feel like you've got that support, then maybe doing an online wedding planning course is something that is for you. Okay, so number four is, I cannot talk today. <laughs> number four is self-care. So actually everything might be a bit overwhelming for you and perhaps you just need to take a little break have a little headspace and just look after yourself. Perhaps for your wedding day, you actually wanted to start to feel a bit fitter and a bit healthier because you work so damn hard and you don't spend enough time on you. Now is the time to do that. And you may think, well, Lauren, why are you actually featuring this in this video? Because it's got nothing to do with my wedding planning but it does because if you want to feel a certain way on your wedding day, then looking after yourself now will help you do that. One of the things that I use is something called Fit App, F-I-I-T, again, I will link it below. It's an app on my phone, you can stream it to your TV as well, and I blooming love it. I have been a member since January 2019. I joined up post baby number two to help shift the weight and get myself feeling fit and healthy. And I use it every single week, especially during lockdown. I'm doing about two workouts a week. I like to run as well, so I mix it up a little bit. But it is amazing. There are so many instructors on there, some of whom you will probably recognize and know of. They run classes like Pilates and yoga and cardio, there's lots of high intensity workouts because that is what the thing is mainly about. There is so much. There's kettlebell workouts, there's resistant band workouts. There is everything from entry level all the way to advanced. It is incredible. You can do it in your living room. And the amazing thing is it's free. Yes, absolutely free. In fact, I was a free member for 10 months. There is a paid option as well, which I joined because when I joined, you actually got the monitor, which registers your heart rate and your fit points. But not only that, the best part of the paid plan is the fact that you can join live classes with a load of other people and you compete against them on a leaderboard, which for me is amazing because I am way too competitive for my own good. But that really works for me because I will do my workout in the morning watching the leaderboard saying, right, I'm gonna come in the top 10 out of these 40 people. And it pushes me way harder than if there was no leaderboard. And finally, number five is an amazing free resource that you can use online to gain knowledge, gain skills, and just level up your wedding planning. And it is, of course, YouTube. So if you're watching this video, I'm pretty sure you know what YouTube is because we're on YouTube. But I just wanted to add it to the list because it's an incredible, incredible resource. Use it, search on it, guys. There is so much to be learned on here. Most people provide tutorials and how to's. Look up every different type of supplier that there is for your wedding day and see what you can learn and see what you can find out because honestly, it's free. You've got time, go for it. Learn as much as you can, enjoy this time and get excited again about your wedding planning because that is the most important thing. I don't want anyone feeling anxious and overwhelmed. I want you to enjoy this time. So I'm gonna stop being a lunatic. I'm gonna leave you there. I'm having to rush this one because we're all in lockdown, which means my children are at home and they're probably gonna wake up in a minute and we don't want them turning up in the video. So I'm gonna go and I'm gonna see you next week for some more wedding planning goodness. 
Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, then you won't miss next week's video. Have an amazing week, guys. I see you then. Thank you.